happy Wednesday and happy very random day in my life video. I have the day off today because I did work last weekend so I just have a very random Wednesday off. I usually don't take Wednesdays off or work on the weekends but yeah we're gonna go to the mall today and do some Christmas shopping and I need to clean my apartment. Today was laundry day so like don't mind if you see laundry <laughs> up. I literally hang dry everything. Hopefully that all is dry by the time I get back but this is the fit little school girl outfit a little out of my comfort zone but I don't really care I feel kind of cute or whatever it's also the day after my birthday so my birthday was yesterday I did work so I'm kind of acknowledging it today and yeah I'm 25 very crazy to say that feel very old but let's have a good day I'm really excited because I haven't been to the malls yet since it's been like the holiday season so I'm excited to see the decorations and the Christmas trees and everything. Also I'm a little nervous because I love to shop and I cannot be spending money on myself right now. I've spent so much money getting decorations for my apartment the past few weeks. Hopefully today will just be Christmas presents. Actually I only need one Christmas present. And it's kind of hefty so if I find something for myself we'll try and keep it at like a $10 limit or something reasonable all the way to the top this view never gets old it's kind of gloomy but downtown is right over there always very nerve-wracking taking pictures because one I've always gotten kicked out of taking pictures around malls this mall the Glendale Galleria is usually pretty chill the parking lot is huge and the views are amazing so I love taking pictures here but again it's always very nerve-wracking oh no my tie was like messed up pretty cute though all right take two All right, first stop is the Apple store. I heard that if you bring in an old Apple product, you can trade it in for some value and get something with it, obviously. So I really wanted to get my sister an Apple watch for Christmas. I have my old laptop in here that I've had for so long. It's one of those things where, you know, I kept and was like, just keep it, I'll probably need it. I haven't needed it since I got my new laptop two years ago so gonna try and trade that in get my sister a nice birthday present or gift Christmas present <laughs> How much do Apple Watches usually go for? The 9 starts at 400 and then the SE it starts at 249 If it passes on the inspection, it's $80. Okay, yeah. All right, we got the goods. Don't mind the Chipotle workers it's right there. But I ended up getting $80 for that laptop, which was great. Even though I ended up still spending $200. I got the Apple Watch SE and a pink band. I don't really want to take it out because it's all packaged nicely. So I want to keep it that way. And I give it to my sister. Love you, sis, even though you're not going to be watching this video. But now that I have that clunky laptop out of my bag, got some pretzels. This is a lot. Oh my god, I'm not going to eat all this. And I got this like refresher drink. I was gonna get a boba, but this looks super 
super refreshing right now. She said to shake it. This looks bussin'. That's the best thing I've ever had. All right, we're gonna vibe now. Okay, last stop is Target. Thankfully they have one here at the mall. I just need a few things. I really want to go with my New Year's dress, like a New Year's headband. Something like this would be cute. I don't really like the gold, but we'll think on it. I'm more of like a silver. Plus the dress I got was the black and white one, so black and white would be ideal or silver, but yeah, we'll think on it. It's only $3. I can grab some tofu. I've heard great things about this pasta, so we're gonna try it. A little pricey for pasta, but I really wanna go gluten-free as much as I can and see if that helps my skin. I'm breaking out a lot. Gotta restock on the bubbly. I can grab it. Can I get those, please? The star face. Thank you so much. Of course. Much obliged. <laughs> Last thing I need are those. And of course, they're locked up. Thank you. I'm home and very proud of myself for only getting what I needed. I did not spend, well I did spend a lot of money today, but nothing more than what I was already planning on getting today. So, um, oh yeah, the Apple Watch. Really excited about this. I hope, well I know she's gonna like it. I already talked to her if she wanted one and like what color she wanted. I hope she said pink because I got the pink band. But yeah, really excited to give this to her. My sister is literally the best person ever she's so sweet so funny so she deserves that and so much more <laughs> i still have my wetzel's pretzels i knew i wasn't gonna eat it all but i need to put this in the fridge and then like i said i got this dress i'm actually like i know it's not a party dress but i think it's really cute and it was on sale for ten dollars so i don't know i've kind of transitioned into like trying to go all like fancy and all out into just being like super casual and relaxed i was thinking about that on the car ride home like how i do that with my hair as well like my hair is so healthy because i just like don't care anymore to like straighten or curl it to make it look good like i literally just i don't know i'm just such a chill person when it comes to like how i look obviously i love dressing up and looking cute but yeah i think this will be perfect for the aesthetic that i've been getting into which is very dark and laid back and then i did end up getting these i don't know i'm thinking that if maybe i can take like the gold off there's also four of them so like i can give some to my friends as well they're only three dollars for four at target so i was like whatever i think we can make it work the rest you already saw i should have got more food now that i think about it i don't really have much groceries it's always weird when i have like a random day off in the middle of the week and then i work last weekend 
so it's hard to plan out my meals and my groceries that way. I don't know. I think we can make like a Caesar salad tonight though. Also had to get these because my laundry machine, I don't think is the one that you can put liquid detergent in, which is what I have. So I had to get the Tide Pods, which I hate doing because they never like dissolved all the way for me when I always stay in my clothes. But yeah, that was my first time doing laundry here today. So also on that note, I underestimated how big my laundry basket is and how much laundry it was holding. So now I have literally clothes drying everywhere like it's a complete disaster in my apartment right now like i haven't put away these dishes since last night my bed isn't made hopefully this is dry it's like silk so they usually dry pretty fast there's one here got the bathroom situation oh my god haven't really put my stuff away since getting ready this morning yeah it was nice to go to the mall and forget about all this for a few hours but now we're back and we need to clean so i'm gonna turn on my tv and put on music i'll show you actually this is my favorite thing to do if you have a roku well i guess if you have spotify as well playing music from my tv perfect all right i'm gonna get in some comfy clothes and deal with this mess made i said i was gonna make a caesar salad but the more i thought about it the more i was dreading making a caesar salad because the dressing that i got is just not it i got it from target so i think i'm gonna have to get a different one from trader joe's or something i don't know caesar 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 dressing is always like a hit or miss it's, i don't know it's weird but I just made the rest of like the vegetables that I had left in my fridge, some pasta, quinoa, avocado, and then these like meatless meat chicken thingies. They're not chicken, but that's what they're called. It tastes like chicken. Anyways, hope it's busting. Wish there, well, I know it will be, but wish there was more vegetables. On a more important note, <laughs> I'm kind of freaking out a little bit because my TikTok that I posted decorating my room is blowing up and when i mean blowing up it has i posted it this morning and it has half a million views already it's literally just me decorating my apartment and yeah half a million views i'm like i should have had an amazon like list i don't really know what to call it like something on amazon where people can go and buy the stuff that i bought and that i have on my amazon so that like if they buy it from me like i get commission it's like a thing if you don't know it's it's like a thing and people make a lot of money by doing that and promoting their amazon stuff but and i know i've looked into it before and i couldn't figure it out because it's so confusing but now i think i know how to do it so I, I don't know if i can like just do this right now or if i have to apply anyways if i can figure this out I want to like post my Amazon list right away. So many people are like, drop the links, drop the links. I'm like, I don't know how. Thank you for applying. I have associate ID number. That sucks, you have to like apply. That's crazy though. At least I know, like people really do love how I decorate, which is like, it makes me so happy because I love how I decorate. And it was really only when like I left my my last relationship with my ex-boyfriend and then moved out and like became so independent and like found my style and my 
aesthetic like I wasn't always like this like I used to wear like pink and like bright colors but like the more I started to really zone in on like what I really like and you know what I want my aesthetic to be like I love black I love dark I love neon signs I love different lights like it's it, I don't know it's just really cool to see other people like what I do like how I decorate and just like all the there's how many comments are there on this video there's over 400 comments on this video not a single one of them I've been replying to every one of them and not a single one is a hate comment which is crazy for me because <laughs> there's always something but everyone's like yes love this oh my god red and black yes like oh it just makes me so happy so uh, yeah that's cool I think if I already had that list half a million people saw this bro and it's still going up I don't know I'm freaking out a little bit it's really cool to see a video pop off like on something that you're so passionate about like I really do love decorating and interior design <laughs> and people have been like come to my apartment I'm like I would like if anybody that like, gave me like I, that's what I'm good at I'm good at like taking a vision and bringing it to life hence me being a video editor like somebody if you have a vision or we're going on a trip I can envision like what the video will be I can envision like I envisioned this apartment in which I <laughs> okay I promise the next video will be the room tour I will go more in depth especially now if like people really really want to know they're like where is this from where's this from I'm like Amazon but there's a lot of other different things like yes most of my stuff is from Amazon but also Ross and also thrifted and that's pretty much it oh and Ikea I need to like eat I feel like Yeah, that's buzzing. Mm-hmm. Okay, this is what I think I have to do for now. It let me, like, make links, but I'm still in the application process of creating my Amazon Associates account. It's like a whole thing. I hope people can see that comment. I felt like you were able to pin a comment. Hmm. I guess not. And my sister's not answering, so I don't know. Look, let me refresh. 479 let's refresh bro <laughs> already apartment is clean by the way and i also just did the dishes from dinner um my comforter or the duvet cover was still wet so that's obviously not how i normally have my bed <laughs> that would be disgusting but yeah that kind of sucks that that's still drying um we're not going to talk about that that is all still drying as well but it is now time for my favorite part of the day to get ready for bed <laughs> today was actually a really good day even though i feel like we didn't do that much i also feel like we did a lot of small things at the same time like we didn't do a lot of big eventful things like i mean i was gonna go to a cafe and like do some editing but we just went to the mall but in between that we made like a bunch of content for tiktok and snapchat which by the way if you don't know i am verified on snapchat now which is super crazy and super cool did not expect to have gotten this far within just a year but it's crazy what enough dedication and determination will we'll, we'll get you but yeah i made a lot of content that i'm really excited to, to post and obviously my tiktok blowing up was really cool it was really nice to see all the christmas decorations and finally finished my christmas shopping got my new year's dress which i'm super excited for new year's I'm super excited to go home in general. The holidays at my parents is just so magical. But we have two weeks. Until then, I'm going to get in bed right now, watch some Love Island, the Australia version, because I already watched all of the US. I tried watching the UK version, but it was a little too hard to understand them in the first season. If anyone watched the UK version, let me know if they if like the later seasons get easier to understand them. <laughs> Because I would watch it. I love that show. But again, you already know. Thank you so much for watching it this far if you have. And if you're a real one, comment the Christmas tree emoji if you have watched it this far. Because Christmas vibes today. And yeah, stay tuned. I promise I'll do the room tour this weekend. So in a few days. I had a great day. I hope 
you had a great day or I hope you have a great night. Hope you have a great weekend or a work, great work day. And I will see you in a few days. Good night. <laughs>